A Saskatoon woman embarked on a unique adventure today, but before she took off, she had a major project to complete. She transformed an old school bus into a home on wheels. Angelina Iranisi shows us inside. Kieran Britton doesn't need a lot of space or a lot of stuff. Her sink is a pail, her fridge a cooler, and her home a school bus. She's transformed it into an RV for a trip down south to mountain climb and surf. Road trips are just a thing in my nature. She bought the bus in September for $2,500, then she got to work. I've just kind of shared ideas, taken ideas. Britton took out the seats and replaced them with a couch, bed and a kitchen. She's made it into a legal RV by insulating the floor, installing a baseboard heater and a porta potty. Her dad helped with the lighting. She also framed walls and put one right behind the driver's seat. That way, if I do get in an accident and things come flying forward, I'm protected by a structural wall. Aside from working on all the logistics, Britton has also worked hard to make the bus feel a little bit like home, including adding these custom built shelves, even making room for a little closet. It's adding these types of little things that make living in a bus feel more like home. She's learned a lot of skills. She's, she's watched some electrical work. Uh, she knows a little bit about plumbing now, a little bit about framing. She's, uh, it's been a real pleasure to work on it with her. Britton has traveled alone before, biking across the country and road tripping last summer. Her parents are used to seeing her go and say this trip is the safest one yet. She has steel around her, comfortable setting, two dogs with her, so we just wish her the best and hope for lots of safe adventures. Ones she can finally embark on now that the bus is complete. She loves the adventure, but she's most looking forward to... Just that feeling of peace. I feel it a lot when I'm on the road, especially when you first take off from somewhere. You have no idea what's going to happen. It's just endless possibilities. And with that in mind, Britain is off. With no real plan in place and no timeline, she'll just see where the road and her bus takes her. Angelina Irnisi, CTV News, Saskatoon.